everybody, I'm Natalia Bonner. It's day 132. Today we're going to be stitching using my inside out machine quilting ruler. Let's get stitching. I'll begin by using my blue Mark Be Gone marker and marking a T right through the center of this block. After I've marked that T, from there I'm going to make measurements, add markings, one inch on the outside of each of those marked lines. After that, I'm ready to begin stitching. I'll begin stitching on the left hand side of the block and I'm going to line up the largest curve on the inside out machine quilting ruler so that the curve intersects the T right in the center of the block. So I'll stitch up to the marked line, adjust my ruler, and stitch back to the opposite marked line. From there, I'll travel along the ditch, moving across the side of the block, up to the top of the block, and then repeating this process on all four sides of the block. So this design is very simplistic as it is, but you could obviously add in fun fills around it, or if you had a couple of these blocks next to each other, it would create some really cool secondary designs. friends I hope you enjoyed today's block and found a little bit of inspiration with my machine quilting now just remember you can pick up the panel the rulers the thread all of the notions that I'm using in this video today over on my website peaceandquilt.com and don't forget to share your progress pictures over on Instagram using the hashtag let's stitch with Natalia that's where we will be selecting winners for weekly prizes see you all tomorrow